ways for living things to reproduce. The first method is asexual reproduction. Some pros are needing only one mate and using less energy. However, since all the DNA is the same, this won't allow for genetic variation. Usually plants and singular cell organisms use this method of reproduction because it's easier for them. There are five different forms of doing asexual reproduction, all which is being displayed currently through comic strips. Planaria, the worm being displayed, is an organism that uses fragmentation, one of the methods of asexual reproduction, to split apart from its tail. Asexual reproduction uses a method of cell division called mitosis. This is when the cell duplicates its DNA, creating two identical daughter cells. This 3D model shows the first three stages of mitosis. The second method is sexual reproduction. Some pros is that the DNA is not duplicated, which allows the ability to adapt and evolve to the environment. On the other hand, it needs two mates and has to use lots of energy. Sexual reproduction is the process of which the sperm fertilizes the egg. There are two different forms of sexual reproduction, external and internal. Sexual reproduction uses a form of cell division called meiosis that allows for the sex cells to create four genetically different cells. Here we have a seal in its natural habitat. It sees another male seal and they start fighting. One seal comes out victorious, sees a female and decides to mate with it. Cells replicate their DNA once during meiosis, from 200 to 100, and then finally 50. After the sex cells have been created, the sperm fuses with the egg to create a zygote. Then it goes under lots of mitosis, from one cell to two, four, eight, and so on, until it forms a ball of cells called morula. After becoming a morula, it undergoes more mitosis until it forms a hollow ball of cells called blastula. The female seal is now pregnant with a baby seal. The seal is now taking form. Now the seal is born and they are happy. Overall, I have learned a lot about the different methods of reproduction. You could create a small bud to externally fertilize an egg. To answer the driving question, life would not be sustained if it weren't for cell division. Cell division is a key element to reproducing new offspring.